Hey guys, it's me Charlie. Today is May 1st, 2012 and today I'm doing a video on some eggs that kind of went bad during the incubation. Some baby button quills were hatching and um, they contaminated the incubator with bacteria and all of my Sarama eggs, that's these right here, were all fertile. And if you guys don't want to see this, you might want to go on to the next video. But it's all the baby chicks that I could have had and this is what happens. So unfortunately, this horrible mess here is all the little baby chicks that just didn't make it. This one here, that one, um, this one, and that one were eBay chicks, Sarama, Silk Sarama. I only got one of those. I would have had three black ones and two white ones. And that would have been three, four, five. I guess there's supposed to be six. I don't know where the other one's at. But they were the Silk Sarama. And then the rest of these would have been Fernando's eggs. And this one here looks so pretty. It looks like it's silver and white. So that would have been something really pretty. But um, every single egg was fertile. Some of them kind of stopped doing the process of incubation like there and there. I kind of know what happened there. Um, the heater in the house was shut off for one week. And when that happened, the temperature went too high and I think killed the eggs. But the other eggs that were in here, they were probably around the edge of the incubator and they survived. So this is what happened. I feel terrible that all these little babies didn't get the chance to hatch. They were almost about to hatch any day, but they didn't. And they were like seven days overdue. So I have some button quill eggs in there. So I'm gonna try it again. I'm gonna do some Silk Saramas and maybe some more Smooth from Fernando. Fernando's a person here in Washington that sold me some uh, button quill eggs for 50 cents each. And that one's black and white, white, silver and white, buff, white, black, 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 black. Oh, so sad. All right. Sorry to show you guys this disgusting video of all these little eggs that just didn't hatch. And some of these were super tiny eggs. I mean, they were like the size of a Coturnix quail egg, like a large Coturnix quail egg. So you can get really small Sarama chicks. Alright, see you guys in the next video. Bye.